spicy chicken wings and possible crafting system in raid hmm what does that mean guys Hey everyone, Cold Brew here. Uh, welcome to another Ray Shadow Legends video. Guys, as always, remember to click that subscribe button, click that like button if you haven't already to support me as a content creator, get that channel growing and help me make more videos. So guys, today we got this picture released on Facebook and we were told basically that this will be something that's going to be coming into the game and it possibly relates to the roadmap uh, that we guys know. As you guys know on the roadmap, there's the final part and it's called you know um mythical crafting if i remember correctly mythical artifacts so um i'll quickly show you the post here so this is the post that was on facebook basically said uh, a new artifact set has been spotted by the royal scryers but how does one procure these mighty items of power what do you think raiders i mean it's an obvious uh crafting system is going to take a hundred thousand uh silver i guess this is possibly going to change by the time they actually release it so you're going to insert some crafting materials in it from what we see here and it's going to give us a new set this set really looks like one of the sets we already have so you see the the, the two colors in there uh it really looks like sets we already have but it's not going to be those um so it's possibly going to be like a divine life set but I don't think it's just gonna be divine life what i uh, what i do think this is gonna be a way for you to basically make new items make divine sets make the new sets that will be coming into the game uh in the future and it's i don't know if this actually means that you'll be able to manipulate the stats of that item because uh this one basically means i think it it will be like a life set but this this is the speed glyph icon so does that mean that you selectively add the speed substat in an item i hope that's the case because this will make our life so much easier it's going to make players be able to make items for a set that they will benefit from and actually choose to have a speed substat in there and then hopefully go and upgrade it and get you know the uh, upgrade on it but um we don't have any more information so it's all guesswork from here on so i'm not gonna bore you with those details the important thing guys is the chicken challenge don't know what the chicken challenge is i'll show you a very quick video it's like a one minute long video uh, it was released by Plarium like uh, a couple of days ago i posted this on my official discord link down below in the description but also i posted it as a post on my youtube page so if you guys are watching this you might have seen this already but you probably didn't react to it so let me put this on full screen and you guys will see uh <laughs> you guys will see the video so it's one minute long so eight streamers saf Stu, deadwood it's gonna be hades manival bge scratch and me of course <laughs> those pictures are <laughs> yeah so random champions it says no dupes fight every opponent on the list battles tears and blood okay that's a bit extreme a dreadful forfeit for the loser and chickens <laughs> giveaways and prizes for subscribers that's cool okay limited legendaries yeah it's one of i'll tell you guys what this um competition involves but this is it basically tiebreakers in a case of draw subscribe to witness epic battles yeah subscribe if you haven't already and get a chance to earn rewards chickens of course yeah that's gonna be cool okay so guys basically what the the chicken challenge is gonna be is it's gonna be eight content creators we're gonna be split into two groups two big groups so two streams this saturday and this sunday uh we'll release the times uh, as soon as we know them exactly but be sure to subscribe to every one of us and to our twitch channels follow the the twitch channels don't subscribe if you don't want to um follow the twitch channel so you know when we are all live so we can do this thing what it is gonna be it's gonna be me versus Stu. that's the important thing is and it's also gonna be uh manable versus saf uh, on our day so on sunday this sunday we'll be doing our pvp fights it won't be against each other in the sense my team versus his team but it will be uh, in the sense that we'll go this will be our list in classic arena and we'll have to go through every single team in the list and try to beat 15 opponents so 15 teams with a specific set of champions so 
how is the champions gonna be selected how are the champions gonna be selected so of course every one of us has different champions and unfortunately i think there's gonna be like a bit of uneven things with manable versus sap because manable has like 200 legendaries or something all with uh, over 300 speed i don't know <laughs> and sap has you know a normal amount of legendaries for a content creator and i also have much fewer legendaries than than Stu, but still i do have a good amount of legendaries and epics so it's not going to be only legendaries against legendaries it's not going to be that kind of uh pvp fight it's going to be guys basically 30 champions in in the selection okay imagine that so 10 legendary champions i'll have to select 10 legendaries from my team so i'll probably pick 100 chance i'll pick arbiter i'll pick maybe uh gurgo i'll pick mountain king razin uh you know rotos molly duchess ghostborn lisander i'll find 10 legendaries that i have i think i do have 10 legendaries that are proper and solid and then i'll have to pick 20 epic champions also so epic champions i do have many epic champions that could be used i've got cardinal golden reaper uh Silar. i've got these kind of champions skull crown i've got champions even to do uh you know a blender team but i don't think a blender team is gonna work because i also need a ton of speed so yeah 20 champions and then once we select those 30 champions six champions out of those will be randomly selected uh we're gonna use a, a randomizer and you know uh six champions will be randomly selected and i'll have to form a, a team out of those six but before i form a team the enemy so in my case Stu gaming will have to form um uh he can apply basically a veto what a veto means is he blocks that champion out of my my uh, game so uh, let's say i get so lucky i get arbiter in my six champions out of 30 Stu will come of course and, and say okay Goldbrew, no, 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 take that, take that arbiter back and pick another champion. And the way I'll pick is again through a randomizer. I don't know if you can actually get, get the same champion again. Uh, I, we didn't specify that in the, in the rules, but still, okay, it's six champions and it's going to be very hard for us to beat battles. It's going to be 15 battles in, in gold four. Of course, I'll be trying to stay as low as I can in gold four because there's something that happens to the losers who don't manage to win their battles and after each battle they'll have to do something so what they'll do is we're gonna each go buy or cook or whatever hot wings guys if you don't know hot wings are basically hot and you sweat if you don't handle your spice properly what Stu already did and will do is have his wife cook uh carolina reaper which is very hot kind of uh hot wings for him to to eat when he uh, loses a fight so i'll need your help guys to be there on the stream and to tell me okay you have to ban Stu's ex champion of course if it's too overpowered i'll know already but of course i'll need your input as well because i'll be streaming live every one of us will be streaming live during that time so it's gonna be cool it's gonna be cool so uh, i'll have to make Stu like have the weakest team as possible so that veto that ban of a champion will have to be very specific and i'll hope he gets very hard teams so he actually eats a ton of hot wings you know with the the carolina reaper um sauce or whatever so he kind of sweats all the time i do handle my spice but uh we don't have really spicy chicken here in cyprus and where i'm from uh it's it's a small country in the mediterranean guys if you don't know already so a very small country we don't eat spicy food it's, we're not used to spicy food we're like uh greeks uh greeks don't eat spicy food as well so what we eat is mostly you know mediterranean kind of food uh Zanzi, you guys know uh, so we eat that kind of food but i i myself eat spicy food not that often but i do eat it i like it i sometimes order it specifically to you know feel that heat and i also have always in my apartment in my house have some spicy sauces to just add to my food whenever i can and for this specific occasion i'm gonna add it a little bit of more spice to my food just to make it extra uh you know uh dangerous for me to lose the fight and actually feel the pain if i lose uh <laughs> if i lose a a match so i'll show you guys what i'll have during that day but also when i i cook either i cook the chicken or order chicken but have you know extra spicy sauce on the side i'll show you what i have okay guys i have this this is called uh rio de janeiro style hot sauce 
it's not that it's not that spicy to be honest it's okay i've got these other other two so this is smoking jamaican hot sauce this is mexican style hot sauce so i've got these three so far i also have this one this is called uh outback my outback is burning hot sauce and guys i also have jalapenos with which i love jalapeno peppers i love to add them to my food so i'll have those as well i also have jalapeno just sauce oh you guys can, can't see it because of the green screen can i do this no no it, it it blocks it because of the green screen so it's it's jalapeno sauce it's it's green it's just green uh and i also have sriracha uh you guys like are guaranteed to know sriracha so i have all these sauces i'll make a, a super hot sauce but i also have them together with me during the stream just to add those a little bit if you guys can convince me to add them of course so i'll need you guys to be there watching the stream you guys can cause a lot of pain to me it's gonna be fun i'll, I'll regret it the next day but it's all you know in the name of fun having fun with the other content creators and you guys as viewers it's it's gonna be a ton of fun even if i don't win the whole thing it's gonna be a one-time thing you know a ton of fun and i'll also save the stream in case you cannot make it guys i'll save the stream and post it on youtube for you guys to watch as the whole thing and uh, in my point of view not i don't think i'll be able to show everyone else's uh but yeah i'll be able to show you guys you know just my recording of the whole thing uh, and it should be fun nevertheless just uh you guys watching it but yeah, I'll be having all those sauces with me, but I'll also have, you know, in case it gets too hot, I'll have some yogurt or something, some milk, just to drink or eat and to get the spice off of my uh, off my mouth. But it, it will be a ton of fun, I guarantee it. And we need to get Stu uh, to eat as many Carolina Reapers as we can. I'll, I'll maybe message him and, and ask him to do, if we can do like an extra bit of competition between us, maybe use some uncommons. Uh, because I know he has uncommons as well. I also have a few uncommons. Maybe we can use an army gear or a Zephyr sniper in there just for fun, just for one fight, maybe to make this extra bit extra spicy. So these are the news, guys. I hope you guys are excited about this Sunday. Uh, be sure to follow me again on Twitch and subscribe to this YouTube channel so you guys are notified when the video comes up or on Twitch when I'm actually live during Sunday doing the uh the spicy contest so it's gonna be a ton of fun and i want you guys to be there thanks a lot guys for watching subscribe if you haven't already as always leave it a like leave a comment help the videos go up uh you know in the view list and yeah i'll see you in the next one and of course yeah I'll... <sighs> so many spices thanks guys